Well, we had a great game against Carlton. Uh, um, it uh, it started started off the game uh, much like some of our other games started with a, a drop pass on third down, but uh, we recovered after that and, uh, and and put together a very good offense performance. I think uh, best of all, Connor uh, Bruns had a great game uh, throwing the ball, hit guys in stride for the most part, um, uh, and. Uh, and, and how about Brent, Brent Grabowski having a big game? Uh, you know, I think he came up about 10 yards short of an all-time record. So um, overall, we were very thrilled with that. I thought we, you know, at times ran the ball okay. We didn't put a lot of yards up running, but uh, at least we had that threat to run, which I think is vital in uh, games like that against good defenses. Um, so coming into uh, Carlton now, I think you can see somewhat of a similar defense. They line up in a 4-3, much like Carlton did. Um, most of our conference this year was in a, a three-man front, but uh, they, they run a four-man front. Uh, and uh, so it makes it a little easier to prepare this week just because we've seen, seen it now for a couple weeks in a row. Um, a little bit more athletic at the defense back spots. Um, so I, I don't think we'll have quite as uh, much luck with the deep pass, but uh, um, you know, we'll certainly try to, try to uh, put, force some man-to-man -man issues on, on St. Olaf and uh, see what we can come up with. Uh, Running-wise, I think... Uh, St. Olaf is a very, very tenacious defense. They come at you uh, uh, very hard. They, they try to be you know, a little bit more physical team. Um, maybe play a little bit more like uh, um, uh, Gustavus played as far as that tenacious uh, come at you a little bit. Uh, they don't wait for anything to happen. They try to make it happen defensively. So we'll have to take advantage of that. Uh, um, you know, they'll certainly make some plays, but hopefully we can make enough big plays of our own.